What's up, guys? Luxide here. Hope you're having a wonderful evening, morning, I guess, whatever <laughs> whatever time it is for you. Obviously, this video is coming out at a different time than I normally would launch a video. And this is you know based on a suggestion by Austin Hilton. Now, if you're not familiar with Austin Hilton, he is also a YouTube content creator, creates tons of content, you know, huge, huge channel. And he has helped me grow my channel, give me guidance as my channel has been growing here as well. So appreciate, obviously, the suggestion, Austin. If you haven't already, make sure you go to his channel too. Hit that subscribe button there as well. So the Vassal Hard Fork for Cardano is now live. Okay, it went live actually uh, about, about 12 hours ago. And things seem to be going well so far. There are some exchanges that have... Uh, ended up suspending withdrawals and deposits uh, ahead of the Vassal Hard Fork. You know, just kind of in anticipation of this changeover, make sure there's obviously not any issues. Now, Bitpanda is one of the ones that had jumped on board uh, most recently. So it joined the list of exchanges that were supporting the Vassal upgrade. And they, again, have said that deposits and withdrawals are temporarily going to be disabled. Now, we don't have a time frame as to when these are going to be re-enabled, okay, or, you know, if they already are re-enabled, that's even better. So then, <laughs> you know, but there are, there's a countless list of exchanges that are doing this. Again, it's just a precautionary measure. You know, you never know with, with hard forks, how things are going to go. So it's just, you know, don't panic. Obviously, if, if you're, you know, in one of these exchanges, this, this does happen. Okay. This is not the first time that this has happened in just preparation for this. And some of the other more notable, larger exchanges that you may have heard of, you know, your, your Binance, your Coinbase, places like that are doing the exact same thing. Okay. Now this hard fork is a little bit different than what you may normally see. So the term hard fork refers to a radical change in a certain blockchain. Usually a hard fork chain starts from scratch, but this is not the case for Cardano. Instead, uh, instead of halting the protocol to implement new updates, Cardano conducts hard fork combinator events to ensure a seamless transition. The current Cardano chain combines old blocks from the previous eras, which is why there's no need for drastic adjustments. This is also the same reason that when the Cardano uh, Vassal hard fork was launched, you know, well, what now would be yesterday, um, there wasn't any downtime. Like, you know, if you if you weren't even aware that the Vassal hard fork was was going on, right? You you would have been none the wiser. You would have no idea that we are now in a completely different era than we were, you know, this time yesterday. Okay. So this is obviously very cool. And if you're not familiar with Cardano, you know, it's it's a growing chain. There's there's so there's so many good things that are going to be coming. It's just insane. You know, you have scalability, you have cheap transaction fees, you have um the ability for devs to create projects easily and efficiently and less expensively, expensively. I'm not sure even sure. Yeah. Yes. Yes. Expensively. All right. We'll go with that. But, you know, obviously, you know, we try to keep you guys updated on all things Cardano. So it's very cool to see, obviously, that this is happening. This is a very pivotal moment for Cardano because now it gives it the opportunity to scale even faster than it already was doing. And the growth just this year has been absolutely incredible. Cardano is one of my favorite, uh, my favorite projects to talk about just because, you know, there's a chance that it could become the leading chain in all of crypto. So as always, I appreciate you guys stopping out. Hopefully you took something positive away from this video. If you haven't already, or if you are new to the channel, which you might be again because of the time that this video is coming out, make sure you go ahead, hit that subscribe button, hit the little bell. Again, you get notified when content is live here on my channel. Hope you guys have a wonderful day, a wonderful end of your week, and I hope to see you in the next video. Take care.